Authority Local Forecast. Well, thanks again for staying with us on this Wednesday. Rob, we can celebrate today because only some of us <laughs> got to triple digit temps. <laughs> yeah, some of us. And you know what? Pretty soon it's going to be all of us and it's going to be way up. Wouldn't want to leave anyone out. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. I think everybody's going to be included in the triple digit party really, really soon. But for at least now, we can celebrate the fact that we're near normal or a little bit below normal for some of us here in the desert southwest. Again, savor the flavor because uh, things are going to change in a pretty big hurry. Your RV World Human Sky Cam giving you a glimpse of, well, what's been a semi-murky day here in the desert southwest. I mean, Brandon Mejia during the break was talking about how cloudy it was earlier in the day. We've had the intermittent clouds kind of rolling through the desert southwest, and that's kind of helped with the temperatures a little bit today as well. As far as your satellite radar is concerned, those clouds coming from the East Pacific. So that flow continues as we get on into this evening. So don't be surprised if we have a partly cloudy to, well, mostly cloudy evening ahead. But as far as precipitation chances are concerned, mm -mm, not looking good in that particular regard. But what's looking promising in the heat realm is the excessive heat watch. Now, this isn't in effect now, so don't worry about it, at least for the meantime. But by Monday, this could likely become an excessive heat warning. So don't be surprised if that happens. That should go until Wednesday of next week. But uh, there'll be a buildup between now and that particular time. Now, wind speeds certainly getting cranked up a little bit over in the Imperial Valley between 20 to 25 miles per hour just in the valley alone. And then we get into the temperature realm of things. As you can see, a lot of us in the high end 90s and uh, Holtville was at that triple digit that just dropped just a little bit. But then we go over to the eastern part of the desert southwest. and You can see that we've gotten into the triple digit party. So again, about 50 50, you know, half of us in the triple digits, half of us not. So that's uh, a victory in of itself. But then that victory will fade in the coming days. But temporarily speaking, we got below average conditions that should prevail at least in the desert southwest for a day before we slowly but surely start to get a rise in the mercury. Again, high pressure well to the south is going to be responsible for that. And for your metrocast, we're talking 96 degrees by 7 p.m. this evening, and then we'll get to the low end 80s as we get to the midnight hour, and then we'll wake up to about the mid 70s. And of course, for your extended forecast, you can see that we are going to have another nice day. This could be the coming, the, the, the farewell tour of the 90s for Thursday, and then, uh, yeah, temperatures are going way up. I mean, we're talking ridiculous levels. Maybe not record breaking, but certainly near record temperatures, but excessive nonetheless, starting Monday, going through Wednesday. And folks, it could go week long. I hate to say it, Oof. but that is a possibility. I'm staying inside, Rob. <laughs> Thanks for that, my friend. Still ahead, amputee.